Lumberjack System is a muscular, real-time, on-location logging and pre-edit tool for Final Cut Pro 10. It's called Lumberjack, well, because a lumberjack is a logger. It has both a browser-based interface for logging on any device that can run a browser and connect to the internet, and an iOS interface that can be used where there is no internet connection. They integrate through an online server in the cloud and synchronize directly with the Lumberyard desktop app for integration with Final Cut Pro 10. The logger is a very straightforward interface. It is set out with a structure that starts with location, includes people, activities, and provides for other keywords. The way we use these can vary from project to project. In this example, I'm logging an interview, so most of the logging will be done in the other column to log the content of the interview. In this example of a cooking show, you can see that the activities are the most important logging to be done. Back to logging an interview. We start logging. We are in Bob Moravis's garage and we're interviewing Bob. You'll notice that the timer has turned red to show that we are now logging. We ask the first question of the interview and Bob starts talking about the Burbank Road Kings a dragster car club he and his friends were part of in the 1950s and 1960s. The Burbank Road Kings used Bob's Big Boy in Toluca Lake as their informal headquarters, gathering there every Friday night to show off their cars and to socialise. To this day, if you go to Bob's Big Boy on a Friday night, you can see the Burbank Road Kings and their cars. Eventually, Bob stops talking about the Burbank Road Kings, but continues to talk about Bob's Big Boy and starts talking about food fights. Unfortunately, we don't have a keyword for food fights, so we need to add a keyword on the fly. Simply enter the new keyword, food fights, and return to the logger. Because we've lost time adding the keyword, we need to set the logger to log 10 seconds earlier to compensate. This built-in time machine allows us to log content that we might have missed, as well as compensating for the time it takes to add new keywords. We continue this way, until the interview is finished and we stop logging. We're presented with the opportunity here to view the metadata logs. This is really valuable as you can see how much time has been logged against each keyword. If you have a particular shot list that you need to get, you'll know you have the coverage you need. You can review this at any time during the logging, either on the logging screen or any other device logged into the same event. Below the list of durations for each keyword, is the actual log as it exists for the event. Once we're done reviewing, there's nothing further to do. The logs are safely in the cloud, ready to be accessed via the Lumberyard desktop app and merged with media information from Final Cut Pro 10. Back in Final Cut Pro 10, we ingest the media exactly as we would normally do. These interview clips have been imported but are not logged. This is where I would make multi-clips or synchronize double system before exporting the XML for synchronizing with the logs. When ready, export the event XML. Jumping over to the Lumberyard application, I unlock it. Keeping with the theme, a Lumberyard is where logs are processed. The next step is to import the XML I just exported. The list of media names and start times is listed on the left. And when I choose the matching event from those on this account, we can check whether the times are in the right ballpark. If you discover that the times are not correlating, you can apply an offset to the media up to 99 hours in either direction in hours, minutes and seconds. You will notice if I apply an offset that the media times ripple to match so you can be confident the media and logs will match. We don't have any time offset in this project, so all I'm going to do is to click Send to Final Cut Pro and that's our work done. So send it to Final Cut Pro and choose the library to import into. After a brief import time, we have a new fully logged event in the library. You can now see that everything is logged. We applied the interview keyword across the entire time range of the media file. But this time range is where we logged Burbank Road Kings and this is where we logged Bob's Big Boy. You can see the overlapping keyword ranges. All of these keyword collections are organized into activity, location, people, and other keyword folders. 
So in this keyword collection for the Burbank Road Kings, we can see all the places where the Burbank Road Kings have been mentioned across all the interviews. Likewise with Bob's Big Boy. So you have the interviews fully logged less than five minutes after the end of ingest, allowing for export and import times. If that's all we did for $9.99 a month, I'm sure you'll agree it's great value. But that's not all that Lumberjack does for you. What is the next thing that you would do as an editor? Well, you'd take these selects and string them out in a timeline to start editing. Seems reasonable enough. So we do that for you. Back in the Lumberyard app, we can add string outs for people, activities and other keywords. For this project, only the other keyword string outs make sense, so that's all I've used. If there are more than three clips with the same keyword applied, we do a string out of the selects defined by the keyword ranges. If you sort by duration, you can see immediately which keywords have the most content, and that is where you're most likely to find the important stories. So, if we open up that Burbank Road Kings compound clip string out, you can see all the clips for that keyword collection. Not only is everything strung out in time order, the first time a person comes on screen, we provide a simple lower third identification. This allows the editor to know exactly who is on camera and absolves them of responsibility for spelling errors. Of course, you can drag a more sophisticated title over the simple one and Final Cut Pro 10 will keep the name information. Not only do we fully log your event, but we also get you started on the edit with a string out of keywords, people or activities. Lumberjack's system lets you start editing faster and spend more time doing the job you're there to do and less time getting organised. With select string outs, there are no more empty timelines to taunt you. Put it all together and Lumberjack system gives you more time to be creative.